hello everyone so today I am going to work on a aim offset asset for my bow and arrow system so here is the preview uh, of the bow and arrow aim office offset system that I have developed uh, so I'm gonna create uh, this uh, right left right up and down animations using the center aim in idle aim in animation and I'm going to show you these steps. I'm going to create them uh, inside the Unreal Engine using only this animation and later on I'm going to integrate this to the animation blueprint but that part is not covered in this episode. The reason to implement this is because I had already implemented the aim in system previously but it had some issues when I align in with the reticle and the bow so that's why I thought of revisiting this part and improving it and this episode is sponsored by these generous patrons thank you very much for the support you guys are giving me okay so and my current uh, bow and arrow system it works like this and as you can see uh, my reticle and the uh, bow doesn't quite match and also the hip is kind of odd as well see so yeah to fix that actually this is how I have done it I rotate the character this upper body rotation I do it using uh, by uh, modifying the spine bone so that's why I don't get much don't get much uh, realistic results so therefore I'm gonna replace this part with the aim offset so this is the center of the aim offset I'm gonna use this as the center of the aim offset let's go here um, right how do we go about this yeah uh, let me duplicate this let's call it AO center and in order to um, create an aim offset we have to use this uh, additive animation settings like this and for the base pose let's use the same okay and How do we create an AM offset? All right. Here, let's select Knight RM skeleton. AO O and arrow. No, oh, let's just say bow. okay and let's use a of center right uh, now let's name the horizontal axis as uh, yo and the vertical axis as pitch so this should a uh, minimum is minus 90 maximum is plus 90 similarly here also minus 90 to plus 90 because minus 90 means I'm directly looking down plus 90 means I'm directly looking up right now let's go here and I'm gonna duplicate this and I'll name it AO 
啊。So they should directly look up. For that, let's modify this. Oh, not like that. Twenty here. Another twenty here. Another, wait, how much did I use? Okay, let's go to this view. So it's easier to see. Uh, does it look unrealistic? <laughs> it kind of yes, but okay for now. to see the need to be able to see the other hand all right now I can okay this looks good enough for the up direction Mm, now let's add a key and apply this is a center and this is a up now let's go here and I'll add this one here so it works like this okay now let's duplicate the AO center again and I'll name it AO DAO start with the spine 20 here another 20 is too much 20, 10 here here okay and uh, right arm I think it's all right the way I see it at the moment uh, but this hand should be more to the left oh like this yeah add a key and apply Alright, go to the AO and AO down here. Right now, this would be the way I see it from behind the character. When I look up like this, look down like this. Okay, now similarly, I need left and right as well right now for the left and right let's duplicate this again AO 
left and let's look at this from the top Twenty here. Okay. Maybe twenty-five. Another twenty here. Let's see. Does it look any unnatural? No. It looks all right. and from the neck let's turn the head uh, does that look unnatural maybe only this much right and still not fully turned from the left shoulder this much shoulder should be more like this all right add a key apply cool now similarly duplicate your center all right From the spine, rotate 25 degrees, spine 1, another 25, spine 2. Well, we can just do it only with the spines because, oh no, maybe not. it looks like stretched here the rest I'll do with the hands Let's rotate the head like this. Okay. Oh wait. Add a key somewhere. Oh. 
wait this is wrong I should oh I have made a mistake happened here why did him down turn like this right uh, I undo the changes because I have accidentally added um, some keyframe change in the center that's why things went wrong so now it's okay this is right now this is left this is down this is center and this is up now only thing remaining is right so a all right let's go here and turn from the spine like this look all right it will be stretched though from the left shoulder let's rotate this a little bit and also from the right shoulder okay it's it looks all right maybe let's lift this hand a little bit right now let's add the uh, a all right here and a left here okay now we have the aim offset like this cool and in the next episode uh, let's look into how to integrate this into the actual animation blueprint and resolve the issues that we have in our aiming system so if you would like to support my work you can get the membership of the patreon club the link would be in the description below and thanks for watching see you in the next episode goodbye also the project file update will be available here in the patreon page for download